יבינו מלכנו, חוננו ועננו, יבינו מלכנו, חוננו ועננו, כי אלה בנו and brothers, do you believe it? I don't know where the year flew, but we sing again this beautiful prayer, Avinu Malkeinu. Avinu Malkeinu means our Father, our King, graciously answer us, although we are without merits. Deal with us charitably and lovingly. Save us. Hoshieinu. When I chant this melody, when I sing this melody and listen to the melody, I feel sadness and I feel joy. Sadness because I know another year had passed. I don't know how it flew. Joy is because Hashem gives us a new year, a new chance. So I want to share with you a Hasidic teaching. Rabbi Bunim from Pshischa. Try to say it. Pshischa. He lived in Pshischa, was a uh, Hasidic master, and before the holidays, he told his Hasidim, his followers, he said, the greatest sin is not the sin itself, because sometimes we fail. Our strength is not so powerful, we're not so powerful, and the temptation is huge and big. So, we sin sometimes, we fail. He said the greatest sin is when we don't do teshuva, when we don't try to correct where we failed. This is the greatest sin. I want to share with you uh, a thought where I will be asking teshuva as I do in the last couple of years. My dear rabbi, our sweet rabbi, Rabbi Kogan, gave me a beautiful gift. This is this pin, this button, and I cherish this gift. It says, you have now entered a Lashon Hara free zone. Hurtful speech not allowed. Hurtful speech not allowed. You know, as well as I know, that to criticize and to talk gossip, oh, it's so delicious and so easy. But we believe that it's equivalent to a murder because sometimes we kill somebody's souls and our soul. And this is my decision for this coming year. I'll be working more on love Love your neighbor, your friend, as you love yourself. And as Hillel said, do not do to others what you don't like to be done to you. I don't like when I am uh, 
criticized, let's say, for no reason, or gossip is told about me. I'm sure you don't. And I will try the best not to do those sins, really sins this year. And by the way, you could join me. It's for the new year, there's a sale. It's free. You could join me for free, but the reward is great. My dear sisters and brothers, I pray personally that I'll be worthy to be your shaliach tzibur, your chazan, your messenger. I say it in the hineni, and I say it now. And I want you, if you want, if you will be willing to join me in this prayer for peace on the whole world, America and Israel. And I hope those melodies, those words of the prayers of Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur awaken our hearts. And we pray with the most kavana that we can, for there's so much what to pray for. My wife, Leslie, and I would like to bless each one of you with a year of refua, refua tova, refua shleima, good health, a year of simcha, of joy to us and to the whole world, and most of all, a year of shalom, of peace. Shalom. Shalom. Avinu malke. Have a good year, a sweet year, a year of simcha, love.